I had a check that I needed to deposit, so uh, I pulled into a bank that had an ATM, and just as I was doing that, another car pulled in, um, and so I had to wait. Uh, so what did I do? Well, I got my check ready to deposit, and that took about 20 seconds, and so I settled in to wait, and I started to watch the person in front of me. So she, you know, reached out, she pushed some buttons, and then she pushed some more buttons. She reached over to get her receipt. She reached over and pulled out her cash, and I thought, great, now it's my turn. So I put my car in gear, and I waited. Now, I don't know what she was doing, just organizing her cash, or writing in her check register, or cleaning out her purse. I have no idea. <laughs> because it's been a minute. And then she puts the car in gear, and she starts to pull away. Now, I can hear the engine rev up, and I can see the front of the car lift a little bit. <laughs> but the car doesn't move. So she guns it. I mean, she floors this car. And the front tires are spinning really fast. And her back tires are locked up. And so gunning the engine, she smokes the front tires all the way to the street. And I start honking at her. Because something is clearly wrong here. But she doesn't stop. And so then she guns it again. And she pulls out onto First Avenue. And slowly starts moving again. Spinning her tires the whole way. So she gets about 30 feet and she decides I better pull off the road. So she pulls onto the side street right by the bank parking lot and um, uh, but she's still spinning the front tires and barely moving. So what do I do? Um, I'm trying to figure this out. Do I ignore this? Uh, right? Do I ignore it? Do I, do I just go ahead and make my deposit? Um, do I pull out my phone and start recording this for YouTube? <laughs> do I tell a great story later? Well, yeah. <laughs> so what do we do with this chance encounter? Well, today we're going to listen to the story of a chance encounter on the road from Jerusalem to Gaza. And along the way, we're going to ask the question, what would I do if God wanted me to, choose to chase a stranger on the road? Let's worship. 